for reasons you need a niche market. Key number one, focus when we focus our business to serve a niche market, we create a compact business strategy that knows the ins and outs of our market's needs. Our web page speaks to a select market from an expert point of view. Speaking from authority that respond to a familiar need with a focus is a powerful way to attract your niche market. It is called marketing by attraction, or pull marketing. A niche market may include a million potential buyers, or 10 million potential buyers. A small business website would most likely be pleased with having 10,000 potential buyers, and to get attention from a niche market of 10,000 buyers we will need to focus, you might be inclined to try and sell to a wider market than a specific niche. The broad approach is common and it most often fails because in trying to speak to everyone it speaks to no one. A broad message is lost on all aspects of your market when they have a specific problem to solve. The majority of business websites seem to have fallen for the false idea that a website can sell to the world. The reality is that the web creates a one-to-one -one relationship. Our websites need to be more specific to each aspect of our web market. For instance, a web designer may develop a niche market for business owners that are new to the web. There is also a niche market for those business owners on their second or third web design and the changing needs of that niche. A niche exists for certain professions like a dentist's or a realtor. Dot of all the different kinds of businesses needing a web design, it will be a specialist that can be found quickly, and the business jargon speaks volumes to the client. Key number two, specialize you will need your website to speak about how you specialize in order to attract attention from an important niche that exists within your wider market. Your website may sell picture frames, but you specialize in wooden frames. This would be your primary market, but you can still sell other types of frames. The important thing is to capture your special niche market because it is obviously a big enough market for you to want to specialize in. Creating a web page for a niche market is often referred to as building a landing page when you have more than one niche market to serve. When this happens, then you pull one niche to a certain landing page and pull another niche to a different landing page. Keywords play a big part in which landing page is delivered, call them by name, it helps if your website can address your niche market by name. Something like wooden picture frame lovers should catch their attention and from there you can talk about the unique features of wooden picture frames, why does your business specialize in wooden picture frames and why do you love wood and like to work with wood? When you speak this way about why you truly appreciate wooden frames, your website is expressing your values as a knowledgeable business owner. Your niche market likes this and they identify with your business because they share the same values. Key number three, be of service as you build content for a niche market, you help them to feel right at home. The jargon you use and the solutions you offer provide a unique experience for your niche market that otherwise have to guess if a website really does offer a solution for their specific needs. Your niche market becomes comfortable because you are serving their need to find trust, quality, and respect for the values they share with you. This is an unspoken service because your web pages doesn't say, we are trying to make you feel comfortable and let you know that you belong here with us. But this is what your market feels just the same when your website provides insight and helpful information for choosing products and services you're pulling your niche market in. Your market is not only made more comfortable, they are educated in ways they never knew before. This is because their needs are unique to the special niche they are a part of. The market that loves would probably wouldn't know why a hardwood may suit some projects, but not others. Members of your market may only want the appearance of wood and not care about its other qualities. There are so many things to talk about in providing good service okay, you don't sell wooden picture frames almost every business will have a lot to talk about that is informative for their niche market. As the market become more knowledgeable on the features and functions of a natural product, or your product, then you can educate them on being price-wise so they don't purchase the cheapest product and end up being dissatisfied. Your service needs to extend beyond the price so your market can purchase in the price range and other considerations that is best for them. And this is true whether the final price is high or low. 
Good service provides all the important reasons for spending less or spending more so that the final purchase is without regret. This is truly being of service, and it is that old-time value we loved about the local business owner that we could always trust to keep us safe while giving us their best information. Key number 4. Search engine placement as you build quality content that covers all the bases in your niche market from beginning, curious, to end, sophisticated answers, you will also be completing your own page SEO. You used to pay big dollars to an SEO expert, so the search engines would place your site high on the list for your search terms. Today, it is by providing the quality content that you also complete the SEO for your page. Over the years Google has changed and the new requirements are that your website needs quality and quantity when it comes to relevant web content. An SEO specialist cannot do this for you. They might be able to tweak your content slightly to perform better, but no one can support your market as well as you can. These changes by Google fit perfectly for focusing on your niche market. In the process of providing insight and specialized knowledge for your niche market, your web pages are sharing unique information of quality that search engines want. Search engines are in the business of listing the most relevant pages for a search. By giving your niche market the information that helps them the most you are also giving the search engines the pages they want to deliver. It is called symbiosis. Duh. If you didn't write content for a niche market, you would be writing content to cover a broad market and then your business website would read more like a department store than a specialty shop. But, and this is a big but even a department store needs to have landing pages with a tight focus for a specific niche market. Google will choose pages that provide a specific focus to match a keyword search. Those broad general market descriptions so many business websites use to attract everyone in the world do not capture the interest of any particular market, and they do not attract the interest of search engines. The common search terms used to attract traffic are not specific enough to capture the interest of a niche market. What really happens is that the common search terms act as the default. When there is nothing else to choose then common terms will have to do your website, written for a niche market you are familiar with, is far from common and a niche market will close in on your site with the keywords that identify their need for information.